hey guys hello and welcome to the digital knowledge in this video we are going to teach about the arrays uh, arrays basically has three types likewise uh, rectangular array polar array or last one is path array so let's get start first of all i changed the tab to 3d modeling because uh, this all three arrays are I show in the 3D okay so I just convert it to 3D model okay so first of all we are going to select the 3D view and first I just uh, draw a simple box here simple box nothing as much okay so I can draw here the box now First of all, what we are going to do, we are going to uh, create the rectangular array. Okay, so uh, for that we are going to here and select the rectangular array. Okay, now select the object which is this box and right click. Now you can see here the all the details are show here. So what we are going to do, we are going to change the columns by uh, sorry five rows also we are going to create a rows by five and levels what means the levels now we have only one level but we are going to create five levels so here I input the five now after that you see the distance between that so I can change the distance by two in every in everywhere okay so in all the three axes I go I'm going to change this by two simple two, okay now you can see here the large cube which is square array this is the example of square rectangular array sorry now what we are going to do we are delete all this and now what we are going to do just delete everything and create a one circle again or oh, one rectangular again one rectangular box or square box here small box okay Okay, now what we are going to do now we are learn about the rectangular array so simply go here and click on polar array again select the object right click specify the point I'm going to specify point here now you can see according to point they create a uh, circular array now here you can see here the item will six item is selected to six okay so yeah six box are shown I increase by it by 10 then you can see here the number of box is increased now they tell about the rows so I can put here rows are four so you can see here after that uh, after one row there is another three boxes are added and total four rows are shown or at the last you can see here the levels I can uh, select the levels of three so you can see here the array work like this and after that you can see here the distance between the boxes which I show earlier okay so I can end here and now what we are going to do we are again select all and delete and again create a small box here okay now what we are going to do we are going to learn about the path array so what we are going to do first I select the 
dot view and uh, create some part in polyline okay I can just create the part okay now what we are going to do we are going to create the box in this part okay so I just click here and select the path array now I select the object right click now I select the path and distance I increase by 8 levels I select 3 rows 1 I can just I can change the distance between 12 here we are the path has short and box size is more so it can show here but I can I can reduce the path sorry I can reduce the size of box and show you first I will delete everything now I'm going to top here and create the path create a very small box here so you can understand okay. now I can show you okay now select the object now select the path see the box here in the path okay so this is basically based this is the tutorial based on arrays hope you liked it don't forget to like subscribe my channel see you in the next one till then bye bye